Hey everyone, this is Goku Sun Doobies, and welcome to a special comic book review. This is the review slash read along for Killer Instinct number four of the special Killer Instinct mini series. Basically, it starts back where they're traveling looking for allies. Are you sure this is the place? And he mentions <clears throat> this is the place where his weapon says. And she talking about, you mean you're a guardian spirits because she lost hers. Do you remember when I first sought you out? To join our alliance against Gargos, it wasn't just because you were in possession of the Dragon Spirit. It was because you had heart, courage, and the strength to keep going when others would have faltered. If you say so, I do. The dragon spirit is passed down through the women in your family line, but it is not the spirit chooses its bearer. You must be worthy in order to receive your, or rather receive such an honor. The spirit may have left you, but... It doesn't mean you are less worthy of it. Be strong. Have faith in yourself. Thanks, Coach. But dragon spirits are not... Spirit or not, I can still kick ass. I don't understand... Argonos should be here. He is right in front of you. Or perhaps it's more a matter of simply not being able to see the wood for the trees. Kunra. I should have sensed your sorcery behind this. Where is Argonos? What have you done with him? Nothing, you imbeciles. Observe. There, you see? Hiding in plain sight. What's wrong with him? What did you do to him? Nothing. He is sleeping. And talks about the history of his kind. You want to save the world? Save the world? I seek only to prolong my own existence, child. Some powerful force is meddling with my magics. I will not end up as the others of some mysterious entity. Talking about he will not be drained of his powers. I believe the stolen energy is being bled beyond our dimension into some alien being. If it's to be stopped, I need to trace it to its source. To do that, I need access to the Lost Forge. And that, I need Argonos, or Agonos, however you want to pronounce his name. 
How do we do? Or rather, how do you know he will help? It is in his nature. Over 3,000 years ago, a certain it mentions people safe behind their impregnable walls of their citadel. Their culture was rich with inventors, artists, and soldiers, and sorcerers. Together they crafted an army pow powerful protectors, golems, and gears in bronze. The most powerful bore a wore a mask with three faces, each representing his creators, warrior, engineer, and mage. Embedded in his forehead was the Eye of Ancients, a relic connected to a power outside the boundaries of the world, an invisible tether to the astro plane which of course is where Gargos is from by the way none could oppose them through many tried and for a time the kingdom prospered under protection but like all great civilizations Eventually brought down, they turned upon themselves using automations against each other. Eventually, only one golem remained, the host of the Eye of the Ancients. Over the centuries, he became tool for tyrants. Separated from consciousness of the eye, he was a heartless juggernaut of destruction. Over time, his body began to break down. He replaced his failing cogs and portions with marble and granite. How do you know so much about him? We have a history, he and I, one I hope he can overcome. If the world is to survive this, he came into possession of the kings of Babylon. He restored the jewel and the named the golem Agonos meaning gentle, and then tortured the Creator in the ways of compassion, well, whatever, teachings of compassion and kindness. Agonos repaired the gesture then he provided the merchant's vizier from murdering his master. The traitor was cursed and cast out to walk the earth for eternity. It was you, wasn't it? You were the vizier, the traitor, indeed. And when he learnt I still lived, he pursued me across the world through centuries. Each time I barely escaped from brutal clutches. Now I find my... I must... Beard... Or rather, help. Providing I live that long now. Agonos, listen to me. 
Well, that's so much for listening. Seems he still bears a grudge. Uh, hi? He went that away. My Czar. With the new Ultra Tech enhancements, we've been able to pinpoint the energy signatures of individuals in possession of guardian spirits. We found three in one location. Which ones? The energy traces coordinate with Jago, Tusk, and Argonos. They're all on the Greek island. I must. It must be something important to draw them all to that place. This is rare opportunity. What global defense networks do we have access to? All of them, sir. Then target the island. Destroy it utterly. Wipe it from the face of the earth. Leave not an atom remaining. Agonos, you listen to me. Ugh. I'm not here to fight you, fool. I only want to talk. Very well, then. If this is what it takes for you to heed me, so be it. You will yield, or I will, or you will suffer. Do I have your attention now? Do you think we should intervene? Do that, and Argonos will think we're on Kunral's side, and consider us enemies also. If not, we... Not if we intervene without weapons. Enough of this. As unlikely as it sounds, I mean no ill will. If you will hold still for moments. The earth has sickened. The life is being drained from it. From all. Us all. Man, mage, and monster alike. You must have felt it, even deep in your slumber. Powerful magics are at work here. I must put the past aside. Uh, stop. What is she doing? Leave her. She knows her own, can make up her own mind. Do you recognize me? I am Kim Wu. Once fought side by side to drive out the Shadow Lord Gargos. Now we need your great strength again, big guy. You don't tr you tr don't trust Kunra. Neither do we, but we need him and we need you. 
My dragon spirit has been stolen from me. How or by what, I don't know. But I aim to find out even through its gifts have left me. I'll still give my life to save others because I am a protector of this world. Ugh. Very well then, Agonos. Is she leaving or is he leading us? Only one way to find out. You're welcome. For what? Saving your mummy butt. Fear not, child. Kunra always pays his debts in full. Boy, that doesn't at all sound like what uh, a Lannister would say. And I am not a mummy. You see, you are stronger than you thought. There is a reason that the Dragon Spirit chose you. Have faith in your abilities. And your path will reveal itself. What is this? Wow. Sorry, not very convincing. Behold, the Lost Forge. Look at this. It's our galaxy. The Milky Way in an ancient Greek temple. How's that even possible? I know it didn't say even. I added that. It is said that the warp and of creation is its thinnest here. This is our launch pad, but to use it, we need one more precious item. We must have the Eye of Ancients. Won't you be joining us? I must remain here to act as rather in order to reality otherwise you won't be able to return at all and what'll happen to Agonos if you remove the eye his form here will perish off as a snake sheds its skin his soul will be released by will be no longer held but first he must surrender the eye it has to be his choice to make Thank you, buddy. Here. Excellent. Let's get started. There's no time to lose. And we see missiles. To be continued. And that is the read-along slash review for Killer Instinct number four. Stay tuned sometime in the near future for Killer Instinct number five. I'll see you next time, same YouTube time, same YouTube channel, and happy Halloween.